I have space now. I can do stuff. What's up, party animals? My name is Kezzy, and today I wanted to talk about uh, my gear, my studio, all my stuff. I sold most of it, actually. Most of my hardware stuff is now gone. I sold the Akai Force, the Moto Sculpt, and the Yamaha Reface DX. And here's why. Short answer, they weren't inspiring. And in fact, having all of those options made it extremely stressful to actually make anything. So the Force was the big one. I had been dreaming about it for so long, but when I finally got it, it didn't do what I hoped it would do. The core problem it had, while it had so many features, the thing was jam-packed with anything you could imagine. So if you got $500, you can get a seriously powerful music production studio in a box. That's what it is. However, like anything that just comes out of a box, it's not very good on its own. And it's not, it's not very good at doing everything. And a lot of times I found that I just wish I was on the computer because I have a mouse and a bigger screen. Using stuff on the Force was such a pain. A lot of what I spent time on was finessing the touch screen. And when I'm, when I'm trying to make music, I'm trying not to use a touch screen. And if I do want to use a touch screen, I just use my phone because there's way better apps on the phones. So I got rid of that despite trying so hard to make it worth my while, and I ended up replacing it with the SP404, which you might have seen on TikToks or my YouTube shorts. Secondly, and thirdly, is the Yamaha Reface DX and the Modal Sculpt. Um, I think I have a little jam from the Sculpt, I'll show it at the end, but the those two were not the synthesizers I had wanted. I, I wanted it all. They, they weren't intuitive. Their character was unique to say the least, but it was so far out of the, the ordinary, I struggled to make basic sounds. A lot of times I just wanted a synth that sounded good and to m modify a few parameters depending on the song I wanted to have. And they just did not do that well. The Yamaha was super menu divey. Um, most of what you'd rather do is just plug and play on the presets. Actually programming it was a tedious task. And again, the interface was not optimal. And secondly, the modal sculpt. I didn't like it at all because the sculpt had a interface that was just really, really cluttered. It had too much going on and it didn't have any kind of clear flow. And the worst part is, is while it sounded crazy, I liked using it to make really gritty kind of dubstepy sounds. It wasn't good at making any basic classic analog sounds from normal subtractive synthesis. I wanted a subtractive synthesizer and Obviously, the Yamaha was an FM synth, so that's not it. And the Sculpt was just a bad implementation of it. It wasn't fun to use. While it was insanely powerful, I had more fun using the program on the computer than I did the actual synth. And that's not why I wanted a hardware synth, was so I can plug it into the computer and use it as like a PCIe card or something like that. It was bizarre. So. I got rid of both of them and replaced it with the Roland SH4D. And again, you've probably seen it in my jam videos on uh, the shorts, TikToks, whatevers. And it's super fun. I love the, I love the, um, I love the SP404 and I love the SH4D. Um, bye bye Akai. Hello Roland. I am absolutely vibing with their equipment lately. Soon, I'll be doing uh, in-depth reviews on it, but right now, I just wanted to talk about how free I feel now that I've let go of all of this extra gear that just, I had to learn, and it was such a steep learning curve that I never picked it up because I could just do it on the computer, but better. And so I always did, but I never had that like, jamming on the couch vibe, which is something I really wanted. 
And now, all of the things I own run on batteries and run well. So, immediately more inspired to make music. I can just grab something, start jamming on it immediately. No big, no setup like the Force had, no mess of cables like the Yamaha had, and no clunky UI like the Sculpt had. I'm vibing, and I am excited to share more stuff, more production performance type stuff. So, yeah, uh, oh, and um, the studio's cleared out. So I'm excited, you should be too. Uh, check out all of my socials, Patreon, Coffee. I post stuff everywhere now. So thanks so much for watching, bye bye.